Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. I welcome you all to my channel, Medico Perks. Today's video is about mnemonics for epithelium topic and its types with a pound. So let's get started. Before heading towards mnemonics, we should first of all know what is epithelium. So epithelium is defined as a collection of loosely opposed cells with very small amount of extracellular matrix. Talking about its types, so we have simple squamous epithelium, simple cuboidal epithelium, simple columnar epithelium, stratified squamous non-keratinized epithelium, stratified squamous keratinized epithelium, stratified cuboidal epithelium, stratified columnar epithelium, and in the last, we have transitional epithelium. Now, it's time to head towards the mnemonics, but before moving towards them, we should know that these mnemonics will only work for you guys if you keep the epithelium types in the same sequence in your mind as I have shown you in my video. Let's get started. So, simple squamous epithelium is a mnemonic that is Emma. Imagine an American girl named Emma. Emma is an American girl whose spelling is a double M. I guess it's like this. But I have a single M show for mnemonics purposes. E, Emma ka jo e head that is signifying endothelium. This M head that is signifying mesothelium. And this A head that is signifying alveolar cells. Next, we have simple cuboidal epithelium. This is a mnemonic. It is dog go to kennel. It is like you are ordering your dog to go to his kennel. Dog ka jo D hai, that is signifying ducts of glands. Gonads ka jo on the whole ye jo go hai, wo se ab yaad rakhenge ke gonads ke liye hai. Two is an inferred, so let's neglect it. Or your kennel ka K hai, that is signifying kidney tubules. So on the whole, ye DGK jo humne choose kiya hai, wo iski examples mein fit aagya hai, in places mein jithar ye found ki jata hai. Or phir, moving on towards simple columnar epithelium. Iske liye mnemonic hai, wo hai girls usually intend studying. As you might have noticed that girls are more studious than boys and also hardworking. So maybe you don't like boys ko nahi pasand ka because of this thing. But ye isko remember karne ke liye kachi technique hai. Aap dekh lein. Girls ka jo G hai. That is signifying gallbladder. Iska usually ka jo U hai. That is signifying uterus. Intent ka jo I hai. That is signifying intestine. Or studying ka jo S hai. That is signifying stomach. But ye ek yahan pe baat yaad rakhni hai ki simple columnar ka jo mnemonic hai aur simple cuboidal ka wo mix nahi karna. Cuboidal mein on the whole O bhi aa raha hai aur D bhi aa raha hai. So cuboidal D ki sound hai to dog wala mnemonic ka apne use karna. Phir jo girls wala hai wo phir aap columnar mein fit kar denge. So stratified squamous keratinized epithelium is ki ek hi example hai epidermis. It does not require any mnemonic for remembering because you should know that epidermis is keratinized. This is not a mnemonic. Keratinized is one example of stratified squamous keratinized. Next, stratified squamous non-keratinized. This is non ka jo O hai na, se aapne hai, bas ke three O's aapne iske liye yaad rakhne hai. Ye thar different hai. Um, totally different hai sab examples se, sab se different hai iska mnemonic. O, three O se first O se oral cavity, second O se oropharynx, or third O se oesophagus. American or British ke se spellings hain oesophagus mein usme thoda fark hai. Ek mein E aata hai aur ek mein O se starting hai. To maine O wala pick kiya hai just for any more purposes ki aapko easily remember karne mein zara saani ho. Next we have stratified cuboidal epithelium. Iske liye humne jo mnemonic rakha hai, wo hai pretty squirrels dance. Pretty ka jo P hai, that is signifying pancreas. Squirrels ka jo S hai, that is signifying salivary glands. Or dance ka jo D hai, that is signifying ducts of sweat glands. Or next me just stratified columnar epithelium is ki do hi examples hai conjunctiva or male urethra. 
इसके लिए जो निमोनिक है वो है जैगवार्स माइग्रेट वैसे माइग्रेशन का वर्ड सारे एनिमल्स से फेट आता है बट जैगवार्स मैंने पिक किया है निमोनिक्स पर प्रेजेंस के लिए कंजक्टिवा में जे क्योंकि आता है और जैगवार्स का जो जे है ये मैच करें तो अपने इस तरह से याद रख लें और माइग्रेट का जो एम है डेट इज़ फॉर फॉर मेल जी रेथरा उसकी स्टार्टिंग एम से हो रही है इसलिए Now moving on towards the last one transitional epithelium इसकी भी stratified squamous की retinized epithelium की एक epidermis example की तरह इसकी भी एक example है urothelium तो वो आपको easily याद हो जाएगा different है और एक ही example है I hope you have found my video utterly helpful keep supporting me so that I keep on making these video videos for you thanks for watching subscribe my channel share my videos with your friends like and comment on my video as well thank you khuda hafiz take care